Right. This is an experiment. Don't know how well this will work. Um, been planning to make a video for a while, but I have computer issues and spare time issues. So what I'm going to attempt to do is to record this on my phone and upload it onto the internet from my phone. So, um, some, oh, I think it's more than half a year ago, time flies, um, I uploaded a video of Jordan Peterson talking about overpopulation and a little bit about climate change. And I planned ever since then to make a detailed response video to that, um, which I haven't had time to do, so I'm just going to lay down a few thoughts that I have. Uh, one of the things he says is, um, basically, he rails against the idea that there are too many people in the world. And he seems to think that anyone who thinks that the number of the total number of humans on the planet is too high must therefore want to get rid of some of them. Um, and he asks, you know, who are you going to get rid of? And I would say, it's not that simple. I have, my, my view is that um, choosing to bring new life into the world is something, is a question we need to take very seriously. And I have taken that very seriously, and some might be surprised to know that I am a father of two. I have two young children, um, aged one and two. Um, they're absolutely wonderful, um, amazing little people. And part of being becoming a father at the age of 40, um, after having spent all of my teens, my 20s, and most of my 30s um, quite uh, firmly d decided, um, if you'd asked me five years ago um, whether I was ever going to bring children into the world, my answer would be no. Um, and it would also have been there are too many people on the planet um, wreaking ecological havoc. Um, that's not to say that I didn't like people. I mean, I don't like everybody. Um, but that's, it, it also ties in with the whole anti-natalism idea. Um, and also the... Um, uh, what's the... There's the Voluntary Human Extinction Movement, and there's, there's a lot of other organisations and groups that I like to address. Not in this short video, but um, depending how this goes, um, I may address them further down the road. I might make some more of these if uh, my subscribers and viewers think this is at all worth watching. So, when it comes to the total number of people on the planet, that is the important thing, the bottom line. Um, once a human being is conceived, as far as I'm concerned, um, then we have a duty of care to look after that human being until they're of an age, you know, teenage or in their 20s, um, when they can fully take care of themselves. And as a parent, I take that responsibility very seriously and want to do everything I can to make... Um, I wouldn't say make everything wonderful and, you know, make them happy all the time, the children happy all the time, but um, to help them to become confident and, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, satisfied? Not really. Well, yes and no. It's funny, when there's a camera rolling, it's hard to sometimes gather your thoughts coherently. 
Um, yeah, this is very, very much an experimental video. Um, I shall attempt to um, put something a little bit more coherent together when I'm a little bit more awake. Um, and maybe even make notes and refer to them. Um, but anyway, suffice to say, w with regard to Jordan Peterson, um, I've listened to many of his lectures and talks, and um, I'd reiterate what I put in the notes of that previous video, that I agree with a lot of what he has to say. And I think when he's talking about psychology and um, sorting yourself out and cleaning your room and all of that sort of thing, um, and also interpreting religious ideas in a non-literal way. Um, I think he has a lot to say which is of great value, and he's obviously a very thoughtful person. So, um, I, you know, I wouldn't say I'm a huge fan of his um, in the... In the terms of, you know, I agree with everything he says, I certainly don't agree with everything he says um, but I do agree with a lot um, but when it comes to his idea that um, if you think the world is overpopulated then you also think that humans are a cancer on the planet and that sort of thing it's that Obviously, I can't speak for everybody, but that certainly doesn't apply to me. Anyhow, I'm going to stop this now, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.